Hey, what's up YouTube? Uh, this video is going to be a little quick video on my knapsacks. So, I guess we, well, I guess start over here. This is my double bag knapsack right here. Um, it's got, or also called a soft pack knapsack. Which, it has a uh, tarred canvas. Um, it is somewhat, well, it's not exactly 100% waterproof, but it is water resistant. And I think I like the double bag a lot because I can probably fit my whole weekend into this. It has just got so much space. So, and I made a video about how I usually pack mine. So, if you'd like to know how to pack one, please watch that video. Over here is my Earl pre-war um, hard pack knapsack. Um, I guess sometimes it's called the lunchbox. It still holds a lot, but not as much as the double bag. I barely ever use this thing. Of course, there's the inside. And the reason why it's called a hard pack is because it's got a wooden frame around it. It's very heavy, so I usually don't carry it that much. Of course, I have the blanket up on top of here, and I know in one video I stated that's not what that's for, but you know, this is a pre war impression that would be acceptable for that kind of knapsack. Over here is the what's called the mule collar. It's pretty easy to make. Um, just take a quilt or a blanket or a ground cloth and just roll it in roll it up and attach one end with some rope. It fits over your shoulder. It really doesn't carry much, just just the basic stuff. Um, it works great for if you're wanting to look like um, like you're campaigning. Um, I sometimes will wear a mule collar. Um, they're easy to make. So... I guess that's it for my video, this video for now. Um, if you like my videos, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, keep reenacting.